maybe a few sprinkles, but nothing substantial. And it looks like overall we should be able to avoid any kind of accumulating rain through the next day or two, but then things will start to change. Yes, it may have been a treat for those temperatures to fall as low as they were, but keep in mind we're just beginning to transition into fall. And yes, we do get some warm spells coming back as the moisture starts to return. There's a wave of moisture in the Keys. There's the moisture connected to Tropical Storm Beta off to the west. We will see Beta itself moving into the Mississippi Valley and that will help to shift our winds and that blob of moisture to the south will eventually get here. Looks like mostly end of the week we'll notice those big changes, but mostly subtle changes between here and tomorrow this time with a little more northeast wind pattern, maybe slight relaxing of the wind flow. Maybe a bit of dryness, more so than what we've had today. That could allow some sections of sunshine to get back into the scene, but probably nothing too major as far as a total clear out. I just do believe we'll still have patchy cloud cover in times of overcast. But if it does clear out, especially in South Georgia, your lows can fall into the 50s, maybe as low as 56 or 57. Most of us, though, probably the coolest temperatures we've had since late spring in the lower 60s. You'll be warmer at the immediate coast because the waters are still pretty warm. We'll get back into the upper 70s north, lower 80s south for highs tomorrow. And those winds are still high enough for boaters over Appalachia Bay to keep that small craft advisory in place at least through tomorrow afternoon. Our extended first alert forecast, it does lean warmer, but not to an extreme. Average high is about 87 and we'll be there, or at least in that neighborhood by the end of the week. The moisture returns, as do the rain chances, 40% Friday, maybe upwards of 60% coverage by the weekend. Gotta enjoy the sweater weather while it lasts, right Ava? I love it, it's wonderful. Coming up next, Coach.